Here we are at stage 2.4 of track day and there is a minimum PR requirement of 70.1. That is six of the seven tier one upgrades. I saw a short offer in the game where if you bought upgrades, they would instantly be applied. So I went back to watch my update 8.3 video and saw the final PR requirement for track day was 79.7. .7. I'm applying all of that now. If you look at the bottom, you can see the PR with zero upgrades. I did stages 1.1 to 2.3 that way, and you can see how much this car has already changed. So there's no way around it. You have to have all tier three upgrades to win this car. Might as well spend it now. So let's take a look at the total cost of this, including how much we're gonna get back. The total cost of all tier one and tier three R upgrades is just over 2.5 million. We get back 150,000 in rewards. So the total cost is really 2.35 million. Now, there's also R rewards for each race completed, but I don't know what that's going to be yet. The total cost of tier two gold upgrades is 465, and we get back 100 gold as a reward. So, total gold cost is 365. And note, you also earn fame for each race as well. That's it for day two. Thank you for joining me. Day three will be up in about 24 hours.